Hey guys, it's Di, and I wanted to share a new purchase reveal with you guys today, and it is not a purse. I know if you guys have been watching my channel for a little while, you've probably been sitting back and waiting going, where's her new purse? She hasn't revealed a new purse in a long time. And that was because the next larger purchase that I wanted to get was actually a laptop. So I finally broke down and got it. Um, it was really hard for me to get over the price of this, but I ended up getting the MacBook Pro by Apple. And this is the first Apple computer that I have ever had. We have iPhones and an iPad, but um, the last Apple computer I had was growing up. We had one of those like green screen Apple computers and we used it to play games on. So if you even were, if you even remember those things. So I am a long time PC user of about, you know, 20 plus years. So this was actually a very like scary purchase for me. It's kind of a really, um, I don't know, kind of a daunting thing, like, you know, new operating system and all that kind of stuff. But it is supposedly supposed to be really good as far as the quality and not shutting down constantly and not having all kinds of, like, glitchy problems, um, you know, just being really slow and locking up and turning off and those are all the problems I was having with my old laptop so we shall see but I wanted to go ahead and give my first impressions as a longtime PC user and this being my first Apple computer and I knew that I liked the Apple system from our iPhone and our iPad but obviously computer daily use item one of the biggest questions that I had was about compatibility and um, getting things that I had in Word, Excel, and PowerPoint to also work on this. So this is the 13 inch and I wasn't sure if the 13 inch would be a huge difference for me or if it would bother me and I found that it hasn't. I'm coming from a 15 inch screen and the screen quality is actually so much better than you know what I had on my last laptop. It's you know, I'm sure screens have gotten a lot better in the past four years just on any computer. So it's a noticeable um, you know, quality difference. And then a couple of things to get used to, like just kind of the first things that come to mind. Your kind of launch bar or launch pad or whatever they call it, your main bar to do everything is here at the top. So I'm used to kind of going different places on the computer. So to remember that I have to close a window from up there too has actually been a slight challenge. So instead of clicking down from the right side of the screen, you click down from the left. Um, and so that has been one of the kind of the biggest, I don't know, annoyances so far as I just go to the wrong place to do everything. But, um, it did come with iLife, so it has iMovie and iPhoto on it, and I've just got a little bit of time to start playing around with those. So far, they seem like they're fairly user-friendly. Um, you know, I've got a lot of years of experience built into other programs, so we'll see. Um, and then obviously Safari I was used to using from my other... Um, I products, but the things that did not come with it that I actually got a iTunes gift card to download were called Pages, Keynote, and Numbers, and I haven't had a chance to play with those yet, but those are supposed to make your Word, Excel, and PowerPoint files that you have compatible with using them on this computer. So that is one of the biggest things that I want to work with in the future is making sure that I can comfortably work with files that I have from my old computers and that I can seamlessly get them onto here and work with it. So you guys can probably tell I'm really still kind of iffy about this purchase. I mean, I really like it so far. I used it to play around on the internet last night and, and, and did some updates and that sort of thing. And it was very quick. It didn't lock up at all, which, I, you know, if you had seen my old computer, I was really having some problems with it. But I really, I'm struggling with, like, the price tag and... I'm hoping I can see the justification. Um, so if you guys have any suggestions with how you maybe got comfortable going from one platform to the other, from a PC to an Apple computer, or just kind of like any quirky things that I should know about owning an Apple computer, um, please let me know because this is a totally new thing for me. And, um, you know, overall my first impression is, is that I really like it. Um, the 14 day return period is still in the back of my mind just in case I can't like get over this like justification of how much it costs. 
but we'll see. So, um, you know, I appreciate my husband letting me try it out and, you know, I'm really hoping that it works out. So this is my new computer and this is what I got instead of a handbag. So sorry guys, I don't have a handbag reveal for you today, but thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.